Sakai. Any news of Tomoe? Travelers have been shot dead on the roads in and out of Yoshi Springs. People are afraid to leave or deliver supplies. You think that's our doing? A few archers at strategic points can isolate a whole town. A tactic of yours when you were Clan Nagao's archery master. Tomoe was a good student. Too good. We're fighting your own reflection. We will turn that to our advantage. How do you propose we find these archers? We think like Tomoe. We want to control movement in and out of Yoshi Springs. Where do we put archers? It would be smart to control the main entrance into town. Mm, people already avoid the main road. Archers there would be wasted. That path behind the inn? No. Poor cover, no clear lines of sight. You want to cover the largest territory with the fewest archers. A handful of men could shut down the road to the coast. Yes. I would want someone looking over the bridge into town. So would I. The road south runs along a high ridge. Perfect place to rain down arrows. Tomoe would agree. There's hope for you. Let's go hunting. What else did you teach, Tomoe? I held back nothing. Including why you left Clan Nago? That's no secret. It was time to retire, and the hot spring suited me. But you continued to teach? Not at first. What changed your mind? The bow was my life. Putting it down felt like death. We're getting close. Eyes open. Innocent travelers. Murdered. Let's help their killers follow them across the Sansu River. El Dei Ashiglach! Samurai! Those innocent dead. Tomoe has thrown everything away. Betrayed her people. She is a traitor because the Mongols offer power, wealth, status. It was denied her by birth. Tomoe knew she was born to a lower station than she deserved. Now you're being too kind. 
Kindness can be useful, even to a warrior. Who told you that? Sun Tzu? My uncle. And he didn't tell me. He showed me. Mercy creates a debt. Your uncle showed mercy to people who... Oh, Ambush! How did Tomoe become your student? She showed up at my dojo with her father's makeshift hunting bow and refused to leave. You didn't turn her away? I tried, but she sank arrow after arrow into my targets. I had never seen talent like hers. She must have had training. Her form was wrong. It would have been useless in a real fight. But she had no fear of missing a shot. She never hesitated. A warrior's spirit. No. The killers. I didn't see until it was too late. Sensei Ishikawa! You know the name Ishikawa? I do. I have message. Speak. Sensei, all of Hiyoshi Springs will beg for mercy, like the victims of Hironori now. Silence! Hironori Nagao. Didn't he die fighting bandits? It was decades ago. He was reputed to be a great archer. Did he study with you? No. Tomoe is spreading lies. But there's a seed of truth. She wants us to doubt each other. We are all that stands between Hiyoshi Springs and a bloodbath. Then we stand together. Hmm. We'll plan the town's defense at my dojo. Meet me there and be ready to fight.
Sakai. We must deal with Tomoe's threat against Yoshi Springs before it's too late. I don't understand the fixation on the town. I was born there. Destroying it proves her worth to the Mongols. And humiliates me. But the terrain works in our favor. Two skilled archers can hold off hundreds. Or... We allow the Mongols to take it. Tomoe wins a victory... ...and lets her guard down. Then we strike. Sacrifice Hiyoshi Springs for Tomoe. The sacrifice is worth it! Tomoe would agree, Sensei. Fine, Sakai. If you will attack from the north, we should focus our efforts there. Scout elevated positions, place arrows, and... Listen! Did you hear that? One arrow, one death. to I wondered when Tomoe's new friends would visit. If the point was to kill us, she would have sent more men. Or the point was not to kill, but to delay. Hyoshi Springs, the attack is starting. This way. If I fall today, promise me, keep hunting Tomoe. You two, come here. What is it, my lord? Mongols are heading for Hiroshi Springs. Gather everyone at the inn and stay out of sight. We will deal with them. Yes, my lord. Good sight lines over here. The Mongols won't be able to flank us. We don't have much time. What can we use to our advantage? Not many options. We'll exploit the ones we have. Those barrels could do some damage. Hornet's nests. Excellent distraction. Dry grass. Lure the Mongols in. We'll make sure you have flaming arrows. Take these flaming arrows. And try not to burn yourself or me. Then don't get in my way, Sensei. Get ready. 
The Mongols will be here soon. They're getting closer. Good. Let's demonstrate the way of the bow for them. They're coming downhill. Take them. One arrow, one death, says they. more. So are they. Coming down the main road. I've got them. China, come away. More on the way. now. Ah. There she is. That's Tomoe? Burning the Nagao banner. We can catch her. Oh, she'll be long gone by the time we get there. She's a coward. No. She's mocking me. She knows the last student I trained before her was Hironori Nagao. You said he wasn't your student. Which is it? I was young, prideful, callous. Hironori learned from my example. He led a rebellion to seize the clan and lost but only after butchering Lord Nagao's best men. Hironori didn't die fighting bandits. That was a story to protect Nagao's legacy. There was no saving mine. 
As his teacher, I could never be trusted again. I was granted the mercy to resign my position. I convinced myself the way of the bow had to survive. But the truth is, I am a coward who should have ended it long ago. You told Tomoya all of this. I wanted her to understand what it meant for me to teach again. And like everything else, she turned it against me. You'll never redeem Hironori Nago. And you won't change Tomoe. But today, you saved the people of Hiyoshi Springs. With my new student. I'll need you at Castle Canada. My bow is yours. But Tomoe isn't done yet. We must keep hunting her. We will, Sensei. Lord Sakai, I studied poetry with your uncle. The Mongols have taken Lord Shimura captive. Mm. He will endure. He is strong and resilient, skilled in the art of combat and poetry. Do you practice haiku, my lord? There is no time during war. War is the reason to make time. Haiku allows one to concentrate, eliminate chaos. To find peace. Precisely. My favorite place to ride lies atop the cliff. It is one of many such places. If you look, you will find inspiration all across Tsushima. I hope I can find quiet places like this one, untouched by war. Look for the birds. They will show you the way. Taka's counting on us. I love the kid, but this is too dangerous. It will never work. We'll make it work. Mr. Samurai? You can call me Lord Sakai. <gasps> Forgive me, my lord. I am Kenji, upstanding merchant, renowned sake brewer. And the best swindler on the island. 
That's why he's going to help us rescue my brother from Azamo Bay. That town's a fortress. If the Mongols took it, you'll need an army to penetrate the walls. Or a single delivery of sake. <laughs> It'll never work. Get your sake ready. We'll discuss the plan on the move. Let's have a drink first. Talk this through. Now, Kenji. When we get close to the town, you can hide in the cart with the sake. The Mongols won't search it? Not anymore. It's the same sake delivery I always sell them. They love my Dars. Dars, Mughal, give a Dars now! You've been doing business with the enemy. I keep the Mongols drunk, and they let me keep my head. Oh, say, you sure you want to go through with this? Anything for Taka. How bad is the occupation in Azlomo Bay? A few people fought back. The ones left alive are prisoners or slaves. But you never saw Taka? No. But someone's been working the forge the past few days. Maybe it's your brother. How long have you two known each other? Since I was too young to know better. I was just starting to brew sake. Sold Yuna my first batch. <laughs> Tasted like piss, but it was cheap. For a while, I tried to get Taka's help selling it. Turned out he was too soft. People told him sob stories, and he'd give them sake, free of charge. Mongols. Damn, you two better get in the cart. There aren't many. I can handle them. No, Jin. Taka is so close. Please. All right. Search the car. You said they don't do that. The town gates. I've never seen them this far out here. My hand. Please, please, boy. Two, go. Das, das for Azamo Bay. Aha, das. Hurry up. Just a little farther. What was all that screaming? Doesn't matter. Keep it down. Is that what Taka's going through? Your brother's a skilled blacksmith. They won't treat him like that. You don't know that. We're getting close to quiet. Bongo, what's that you? This is where we part ways. Keep the Mongols drunk and distracted. I'll do my best. Stay safe, Kenji. And you, Lord Sakai. Taka's waiting for us. Let's go. Once we're done, I'll meet you at the crossroads behind town. We need a vantage point to scout ahead. This way. Remember, no alarms. We do this quietly. All the prisoners suffer. Got it. He's in charge. A slaver. Bastard. He's inspecting the prisoners like they're horses. He might lead us to Taka. Follow him. Taka's probably fine. He 
wouldn't try to run. Let's go. Martina! What is his problem? Your blacksmith, Taka. His work is shoddy. I think he's sabotaging you. I know it. Taka's here. He is only blacksmith. No, I am a blacksmith too. And I'll do much better work. I cannot feed two. I get rid of him. But be ready to prove yourself. That bastard! He'll kill Taka! Stay close, you know. I'll find a way through. Jin! We look them in the eye. With courage. Only cowards strike from the shadows. Forgive me, Uncle. The slaver. Can't let him get away. No, please. I need to rest. It's tough. This is Lord Sakai. He'll protect us. I need you to trust me, Tucker. I need your help. I'll try, my lord.
There's a gate nearby. Then that's where we break out. They found the slaver. They'll kill us. We need to hide. No, keep moving. And climb those crates. Where are we going? Kenji's waiting for us at a crossroads. Kenji's with you? If he made it out alive. Horses, they're coming for us. Get in the tall grass and stay down. It's Kenji! Taka! You made it! Were you followed? No, but we can't go back to my place. It's crawling with Mongols. We should go. We have to put some distance between us and Azamo Bay. <laughs> Haven't seen a Mongol since dawn. I think we're clear. We need to figure out where to go next. There's a place up ahead where you can see most of Izuhara. Everyone all right? I could use a drink and some sleep. I can help with one of those. Taka, you've been quiet. First time in days, I haven't felt like I was about to die. My lord, I am grateful. But how do you know Kenji and my sister? I owe you know my life. <laughs> We have something in common. I'm not built for riding all night. Komatsu is just over that ridge. They have a forge. One of the best on the island. Good place to make tools. Maybe something to get gin over the walls of Castle Canada. What do you say, Taka? My lord. I'll do anything to repay you for freeing me. Thank you. Taka, Kenji, get some rest. We can't stay here long. How are you doing? I have my brother back. He's shaken up. Can you get him to Komatsu in one piece? With food and rest, he'll be fine. Your brother wasn't the only prisoner in Azamo Bay. You're going to save them. And make their captors suffer. Good. Right for Komatsu Forge. I'll join you when I can. Jin. Thank you.
My lord, we're going into Azimo Bay. Help us fight. You'll endanger everyone inside if you start a fight. The Mongols are starving and beating our elders, punishing them for a prisoner who escaped. Your elders had nothing to do with that. Where are they being held? One's near the shrine. We think the other two are in the houses. How are you planning to get in? The gates are sealed shut. There's an opening in the fence by the main gate. We used it as children to sneak out. I'll use it to sneak in. Stay out of sight until I've opened all the gates. Thank you, my lord. We don't eat. You don't eat. We need to eat. Go catch fish. Free 
me. You're going to be all right. Are you hurt? I'm fine. They wanted me to heal their sick. And you refused. Stay here until I've dealt with the rest. Please, free our blacksmith, Izumi. The Mongols are holding him in one of the houses. Safe now. I was sure they were going to kill me. They already killed one blacksmith. No, he escaped. You will too. But stay here until it's safe. Not safe here. Run. Shamagur Shukbol resist and be punished. Oh, 
You're going to be all right. Are you the headman? I am. The Mongols threatened to kill my people unless I accepted their rule. I was about to give in. You were strong to resist. Remain hidden until it's safe to come out. The Mongol warlord has taken over my home. Please, drive him out and free us all. You catch fish, we treat you well. Sagas berry, beach on sun. You for not in sight.
samurai. You tortured and abused my people. Accept Mongol rule, and your people will not suffer. You are a liar and a coward. You deserve nothing less than death. I will take nothing less than your head. and that's where we're going to start to wrap things up for this episode if you enjoyed this please hit the thumbs up button if you like your gaming on the daily please consider subscribing i upload at 12 noon uk time every single day of the week so until tomorrow i'll see ya